Hi, I'm Megan. Today we're going to make up a CRI or a constant rate infusion. Uh, I have my orders here to make a fentanyl CRI and it's for um, 1,090 micrograms QS to 100 mils of saline. And the QS stands for quantity sufficient. So if I need to have 1090 micrograms up to a quantity of 100 mils, I have a 100 mil bag of saline, so I need to remove saline from this bag and then add fentanyl to the bag so that the total is 100 mLs. So I've done the calculations and it's 21.8 mils of fentanyl. So I have that drawn up and I have it labeled. And then I also have a syringe so that I can remove saline from this bag. So now I'm going to remove 21.8 mLs of saline before I add the fentanyl. And since I have my fentanyl drawn up in a tuberculin syringe for the 0.8, I'm going to be as exact when I'm removing my saline and remove the 0.8 mLs. The reason we want to be so exact with this is the math for these constant rate infusions is calculated down to the microgram. So I just want to make sure that everything is equal. And so that especially for a fentanyl CRI, I want to make sure that this dog is receiving the right amount of pain medication. So now that I have drawn out 21.8 mils of saline, I am going to add 21.8 mils of fentanyl. Okay, and the last step is to properly label the bag. So I have already made this label up. It has the time, the date, my initials, and then how much drug is added. And now I'm ready to set this up for my patient.